Right then, uh, so what I'm at now is I'm going to make this uh, switch control panel that I designed the other day. Um, I had one similar to this but I've added a couple of switches and I've added back in my 3 meters. Um, anyone that's seen older videos of my shack will know that I've had these uh, main power supply, mains AC supply and auxiliary supply voltages. They're little um, LED jobs like that lad there and uh, I have a little bit more room so I can make um, these and what we're going to do is we're going to make it out of this old PC side panel and I have it marked out so to do a bit of drilling and dremeling and uh, probably a bit of filing so that will be that we'll come back to you when I've all that much done oh hang on so so some considerable time later and lots of filing I hate filing hand filed into a perfect uh, square there's all the hardware so I need to make a bit of a a frame that this kind of sits on because uh, that it's been cut out of the side panel now it's got a bit of a spring to it so I have an idea so here we are uh, believe it or not it took me about three hours to make that so uh, it's done now and uh, that will live in between the amplifier and the tuner and uh, it's just handy because a lot of my power supplies and stuff are located in under the bench so I can remote switch them on and off with this and of course the audio gear is up out of the way as well so I can turn it all on and off with this so um, I added a couple of switches um, this time and I'm going to have the mixer on its own switch because um, sometimes when I'm doing stuff for YouTube and uh, I just need the mixer on, I don't need the whole rack on so I'm going to uh, just have it on its own separate switch so uh, I'm pretty pleased with how it turned out um, it took forever to file it, oh my god it must have been an hour filing it to get it right so it's uh, for something that's hand filed it's reasonably square like it's not perfect but it's as good as I can get it anyway so that's the switch panel out of the way so another little step closer I'll bring this into a place in town and um, I'll get them to scan it and do uh, a nice satin black uh, vinyl decal with printed white text on it as for uh, what the things are for so there we are we'll be back again soon as we progress another bit along in this mammoth task that is the uh, shack rebuild here at the i7ko so uh thanks for watching and we'll get you again soon seven three and bye